Hey there, mamas. Today we're going to be doing the Katrina style fleece longies, which is just fleece pants with no elastic, just fleece to be worn over a fitted diaper or a prefold or a delaminated older diaper as a cover. But it's not just a cover, it works as standalone pants. So my daughter used to wear longies and shorties over prefitteds for bedtime as pajamas. You could make a cute little, you know, matching pajama top. Fleece will hold in as long as the diaper has enough absorbency. So if you've got a really absorbent fitted, you know, then fleece is a good enough cover. So it's a good option. What I have here is a cutout pattern from the Katrina Longies pattern. I will put a link in the description. This is a small and then I've, I tend to make my waistbands with micro fleece instead of regular fleece and I do it one size smaller. So a small, I would then use the extra small sizing for the, for the waistband. And I'm going to make these today with little leg cuffs, like how sweatpants have leg cuffs. And you don't need to do that. You can just fold up the bottom, but I'm going to be doing a little bit of a gathered ankle as well. And the way that these are assembled is pretty simple, but the first thing I'm going to do is make the little leg cuffs since I'm doing leg cuffs. And I'm just gonna go to the outside, the positive side, the attractive side of the fleeces. You know, fold your leg cuff in half, just like you did for the soaker. And then you're just gonna sew it with a zigzag stitch or serge against the bottom and stretch it so that it ends up fitting the whole length while you're serging or while you're sewing. Okay, so the way that we're going to assemble this is very similar to how we made the pants for the for the dolls. We're going to sew up the inside of each leg, which is this bottom part here, the part that's not curved. So now you're going to turn one of them right side in and leave the other one inside out. And you're going to tuck the right side in one in through the body of the inside out one. So that the cuffs line up and the seams are on the same side. Like that. I like to keep my serger tails there, but you can just kind of keep an eye on your seam. And then what you're going to do is just clip or pin these pieces together. And just line it up all the way around. And you're just going to serge or sew all the way through from one side to the other, just making a straight line when you go across the crotch. One thing I do like to do to make it a little more reinforced at the crotch is after that, I like to go with my sewing machine and just do a little seam back and forth to really hold that, that crotch area because that is an area where there's no gusset and it does tend to pull a little bit. And now you're going to put the whole thing so that it's inside out. Now you can see they look a lot like little pants. They're just going to be little pants with a really high rise so that they fit over big diapered butts. And so now we're going to take our waistband, just like we did with the soaker, and we're going to put the attractive sides toward each other, and then sew down the side. And now you're going to fold that in half. And now I like to do it the same way, where I line it up to the back. You can tell which side is the back, because it's much higher up than the front, especially the way that I cut it, where I add a little more even to the back than the front. And you're just going to set it inside. And line up all your seams. And 
And then you're just going to want to either sew with the zigzag stitch or serge around that as well. And you can make these with wool as well. And there's your little fleece Katrina longies or just little fleece sweatpants to be used as a diaper cover. You have to use anti-pill or blizzard fleece for the body. It needs to be a thicker fleece. But the waistband and the leg cuffs can totally be micro fleece to make them stretchier and softer against the baby. Plenty of room in the butt for a fitted. You can always increase your rise if your baby's narrow but needs a big bulky diaper. So you just add some size to the back of the body. You can also make a bigger waistband and have it just kind of be, you know, a higher rise waistband to help it hold better or help it fit better. It's a pretty easy option. It's really quick to sew up. You can use them over old delaminated diapers or you can use them over fitteds or prefolds or flats. So, you know, easy. You could also just buy fleece pants and use them as diaper covers over those things. You don't need to wear a pull cover and fleece pants as long as the fitted or the prefold or whatever has enough absorbency. So there's your Katrina fleece longies. Happy sewing.